Hey, Stacy Mitchell here. I am a beauty junkie. I love to try different beauty products and skincare and makeup and all of that. So I brought you my latest Ipsy bag. This is the August Ipsy bag. I love Ipsy because I get to try a lot of things for a small price. So it's like 10 bucks a month and you get to try all kinds of different products that I wouldn't normally spend my money on. Um, and I get to find out if they're really good or not. Now, I will tell you Ipsy's upping their price. It's going to be $12 a month soon. So um, if I can grandfather myself in, I'll probably stick with it. But, uh, you know, I know it's only two bucks, but I'm very frugal. Anyway, let's just see what's in here. I don't have makeup on because I'm going to try this stuff on right here with you all and see how, uh, see what we think about it. At least four of the five products. So there's five products in here. Um, I do have, I did wash my face. I do have my moisturizer on. The only thing of my skincare that I did not do is eye cream because in this bag is this uh, belief, belief, belief. I wouldn't spell it that way if it's supposed to be belief, but I think that's bad marketing. But um, moisturizing eye balm. Okay, I have to be honest with you, they are going to have to really impress me because I love the eye creams that I already use. And I have like three that I love, 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 and I kind of swap between the three. So in order to impress me with eye creams, you gotta be freaking phenomenal. Um, so this is a sample size. Um, this says, I'm going to give you some info on it. This formula is spiked with comfrey leaf and pennywort herb to flood your under eye air area with hydration for 26 hours. Okay. Um, so it's whether you want to look wide awake or it's time to tuck yourself in the cooling effect feels refreshing and sends puffiness packing. Okay. So this is mostly for puffiness to make you look awake. Um, if you have watched any of my other videos, you know how I feel about my, um, de-puffing eye serum. I can't believe this is going to match. This is just a cream. We're going to try it out. So we're going to go ahead and de-puff. Okay. So it feels good. It's nice and creamy. I'm not, and I'm doing my upper eye too because I'm old and that sags. So we're going to just add a little moisture up there because that's what I do. Um, yeah, it's nice. We'll see how it holds up and how my makeup goes on over it because, you know, that's going to make all the difference in the world. Feels good. We'll see. And using it consistently, that's the thing with skincare. You can try it once and you can't really determine whether you love it or hate it because you have to see, I mean, usually it takes a little time for those things to actually begin to work. Um, but I have to tell you, my depuffing eye serum that I normally use, which is this Hydrofusion, um, feels tons better because it's cool and you can almost feel it depuffing right on the spot. So, uh, so far, not overly impressed, but we'll try it. We'll keep going and we'll see how it goes. This is, okay, not this size because this is a travel size, but the full size, um, bottle of this is 48 bucks so that's a lot more than what I pay for this I don't remember what the price of this is off the top of my head but because I'm a representative I get it at a discount too so you know <laughs> that helps too but if I didn't like it and I liked this better well that would change things because that's how I roll um the one product that I did get in here that I am not going to use today I'll have to do a separate video is this Wander Beauty lift off purifying and brightening peel off masks I love a good mask um, this mask is um, antioxidant, uh, has rich acai, goji berry, and green tea extracts that help heal, purify, and brighten dull skin. Okay, so that sounds fabulous to me. Um, and it says you're not going to get that uncomfy, tight feeling. So the last mask that I got through Ipsy, I felt kind of tight. I wasn't overly impressed with it. We'll see how this one goes later on. I'm not going to do the mask today. Maybe I'll do that tonight. Um, and I'll do another video and talk about this. I will tell you that this is $34, the full size version of it. Um, and I have another charcoal mask that is detoxifying that it's freaking awesome. So again, they got the work cut out for them. We'll see how it goes. Um, but I'm not going to try that on this video. Let's see what else we have in here. So the rest of this is makeup. Okay, so I'm going to hold off for a minute because I need to put a little bit of foundation on. I'm not going to do a lot. It's summertime and I am pretty much just hanging around the house today. So I am using a tinted moisturizer. I'm actually using two tinted moisturizers because there are n there's not a shade that really works for me. So I mix the lightest and the second lightest together to get something kind of in the middle. Um, 
and we're just gonna put that on just enough um, just enough tint to even out my skin tone but um, like I said I'm not doing anything special today I'm wearing a t-shirt and jeans y'all I don't even have my jewelry on yet nothing so I just want something to make me look like I have a naturally even skin tone I don't want to look necessarily completely made up. I'm going to keep it casual. Okay, we're just going to rub the rest of that in because it's nice and moisturizing and, you know, why not? All right, so now that I have that in, let's go ahead. I'll do uh, hair. E, gross. Um, I will do, like, my concealer and stuff. We're going to go ahead and use the products that I have, and then I'll go back and fix up the other things that need to be done, like the concealer and uh, blush because I don't have blush in here either. Um, so let's just throw on a little bit of uh, mascara. So this is the mascara that they gave us. This is Ico Beach Waterproof Mascara. I love a waterproof mascara, especially in the summer because I like to go swimming. Uh, I have yet to find a waterproof mascara anywhere that I'm overly impressed with. Um, so we'll see how this holds up. Maybe we'll have to go to the pool this afternoon. It's supposed to be really hot. We'll see how this goes. What I think it's cool, it's in a little tube. It's like a little squeezy tube. Um, so it's supposed to be, let us let me tell you a little bit about it. It's melt proof mascara. So again, it's gonna be really hot. So this is a good day to try this out. Um, that will take you from the beach to the bar without budging, smudging, or flaking, okay? And I have found that if your most mascaras, if your mascara, mascara flakes, it's probably because it's time to toss it. You've probably had it too long. Um, this formula is loaded with coconut oil, Coconut oil is my favorite thing on earth. Coconut oil is good for everything. I uh, put it on my face, on my skin. I brush my teeth with it. I eat it. Coconut oil is the ideal thing. I'm telling you, I love coconut oil. Um, uh, so coconut oil to help smooth sunscreen, to protect sunscreen in your mascara. Who knew? I don't know. Um, have you ever noticed that before? I've never noticed that before in any of my other mascaras. Uh, fruit extracts to condition your lashes while the wave brush cream creates dramatic volume and length. So um, this is, the full size is $26. Y'all know, I don't usually pay that much for my mascara. There's the brush, let's take a look at that. Doesn't look like anything too fancy. And I'm going to use my mirror over here. Wiggle, 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 you know gotta do the wiggle, wiggle um it looks really nice of course my lashes are the bomb since I've been using the lash serum I'm not gonna lie so what do you think so there's one with one without what do you think it's nice it's a nice mascara there's no doubt I don't know if it's $26 nice cuz you know I'm frugal I like a bargain that's a lot of money for a mascara in my world I have a child. I tend to be a little, oh look at I didn't rub that in very good, that moisturizer. Let's just dab a little bit on my lower lashes. I don't like to get too crazy on my lower lashes because my lower lashes are so long they kind of, you remember the picture of Twiggy um, where she had like almost like those, yeah that's what I start to feel like. And uh, like I said, I'm trying to keep it casual today. So that is Ico Beach Waterproof Mascara. I do like it, what do you think, what do you think? I kind of like it, kind of digging it. Okay, twenty-six dollars full price. Um, a little. I should have done the eyeshadow first. Holy crap! I forgot there was eyeshadow in it. That's okay. We like to do things backwards. Why not? It's fun. This is Suva Beauty eyeshadow in the color coriander. So I tried to find this online, and I could not find this shade. So I don't know if maybe it's part of their, you know, a palette, but I couldn't find it there. Their um, single shadows run eleven dollars, um, but I didn't find this color anywhere. It's a really pretty color. It's a nice neutral color. Now the instructions on here say dip your ring finger or a damp shadow brush. Well, I'm not going to dampen my shadow brush. I'm just going to go ahead and use my ring finger and just do a little overall color um, and see how that goes. Uh, let's see. It's easy to apply. It's opaque. It's water resistant. Um, it's a cream powder hybrid formula. And, um, yeah, so that pretty much, and then it talks about the color being good summer. Oh, look at that. That's really pretty. That's really, and it is cr kind of creamy powdery. I kind of digging it. Okay, I'm going to use my, I should, oh, okay. The pigmentation, especially on something this light. Okay, I'm impressed with this. We're going to 
do a little bit more. So I don't know. I'm going to close my eyes. Can you see the difference? That's really pretty. And again, because I'm doing kind of casual, I like a, just a nice light coverage. Let's do the other one so I don't look off balance. Near, near, near. This is pretty. And it's got a little bit of a sheen to it without being overly sparkly, which is really good because I'm 48 years old, y'all. I don't need glitter on my eyes. Um, it makes me look like I'm trying too hard, frankly. So a nice little sheen that doesn't overemphasize my wrinkles is really nice. So I'm impressed with this. Um, $11. Uh, at least the other singles are. I don't know about this color. I don't know where you find it. If you find it, you, know, you have to do more digging than I did. I just didn't put that much effort in. <laughs> okay, just being real. All right, last product is this. I'm going to jack up the name, y'all. I'm just not a name brand person, so bear with me. Adessa. New York, Adessa, here's the, here it is, A-D-E-S-S-E, -S -S -E. I don't know how you say it, so correct me, you can, you're allowed, write it phonetically in the comments so I know how to say it, um, this is All Day Lip Cream in the shade Thames Street, this creamy moisturizing lippy glides on, it's full coverage, high impact color, it's a nice, pretty neutral, check that out, um, so it's, you know, uh, pinky nude hue works on all skin tones. So let's check this out. Huh, huh, huh. It's very neutral. It feels good. That's good. It feels good going on. It's very creamy. I have to tell you, it doesn't feel overly high end to me. And I like that the color but y'all know I'm used to bright bright lips so when I see nudes are hard but I am going neutral and I don't I do I do like it I do like it I can't lie this is $24 regular price uh, again that's more than what I normally pay and I I don't know maybe it's because I'm used to my less expensive lipsticks but it doesn't feel all that like it's creamy I have a feeling it's not gonna stay on now I'm gonna blot and I'm gonna reapply because that is how you keep lipstick on Mm -mm. Okay, and I'm gonna reapply and we're gonna see and I'll probably do this a couple of times I won't do it on camera, but I will throw out The morning just to see if I can get it to stay and then we'll see how it holds up because that's a big deal. I Don't mind reapplying lipstick. That's not an end-all be-all if it doesn't stay on but it definitely Influences me if something stays on a long time Then I extra love it um, So yeah, we'll see how that goes Okay, so those are my products that I got from Ipsy. Watch for my video later on the Lift Off Purifying Brightening Peel Off Mask, and I'll tell you what I think of that, okay? Um, Y'all have a fabulous, fabulous day. See you later.